If your Twitch streamer wants to get professional sounding audio like this, these are the filters you should add in OBS. So for this specific setup, we're going to be adding an expander, a compressor, a three band equalizer, and finally a limiter to our microphone in this specific order because each filter affects the next one in the chain. Before we turn on any filters, you want to make sure that your raw microphone input is hitting between minus 15 and minus 10 on these audio meters. Now that our microphone input is set correctly, you can come to your filter menu and the first thing we're going to set up is the expander. So make sure that's turned on and then you want to come to the preset menu and then change that from expander to gate instead and these settings should be fine. Next up, we've got compressor. This is basically going to balance out the difference between your loud and quiet sounds. So you want your ratio of four to one, threshold around minus 20, an attack of five milliseconds, a release at 150. And finally, you want to change your output gain so that you're hitting between minus 10 and minus five this time on the audio meters. So for me, that's roughly going to be about five or six decibels. That brings us onto our EQ, which is basically going to stylize our voice a bit. And ideally you want to bring out the bass and the treble while cutting some of the mids of your voice. So I like to add two decibels to our highs, mids minus 1.5 and lows, I add three decibels of gain. And finally, we're going to add a limiter, which we should set up at around minus five.